Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls of the YouTube world, CJ Rose is back in the building. Welcome back to the channel. All right. <clears throat> Hell in the Cell has come. Hell in the Cell has finished. Um. Uh, uh, what do I, what do I say to this? Um, I can just tell you this right now. The first match, the match, the first match of the night and the main event are probably the only two matches that you probably will care about. Because literally those are the only two matches I cared about. <laughs> Every other match was standard. Even the, even the Judgment Day versus AJ Styles from Battle of Morgan, that was kind of standard. But we'll get into that. We'll get into that. For now, let's begin. So. We kicked the night off with the Raw Women's title on the line. Becky Lynch versus Asuka versus Bianca Belair. This match right here, damn good match. A very good way to start the night off. If there's one thing WWE has done late, sometimes, sometimes. What they do sometimes is that they they do put great matches in the beginning of the shows. They do. This was no exception. Uh, so, again, as I said in the predictions and as we all know for the past two to three weeks, that this was not originally the plan. This was not supposed to be the match. It was supposed to be Bianca Belair defending against Naomi with Bianca Belair, of course, coming out on top because Naomi was not going to win the championship. So for this to be the alternate, I'll take it. I'll definitely take it. Definitely a good match. All three of them did their thing. All, That's all I got to say. <laughs> Um, for the beginning of the match, uh, Becky Lynch was pretty much um, controlling the match. She pretty much had Asuka on lock, making sure that she always kept it one on one, which was the smart thing to do. Every time, every time somebody would either Asuka or, or Bianca hit a move, Becky would immediately throw him out the ring and then just keep it one on one. She would always go for the pin because that, like, that's a smart thing to do. But that's gonna catch on. That's gonna catch up to you, and that's actually how it affected the ending. Like, um, hmm, like this. So, uh, I believe Bianca and Oscar in a situation. Becky throws Bianca. No, Becky throws Oscar out, and then Becky goes for the manhandle slam. Boom! Connected on 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 a Beck on Bianca. Covers one, two. Oscar broke it up. Boom, like that. That's one instance. The second one. Um, I think Bianca had a uh, Becky in the KOD position. Oscar kicks Bianca's lights out. She like she's knocked out at this. Point. Like she's knocked out. Boom on the ground. Becky. Rolls Oscar out again. Becky goes for the cover. One, two. Oscar breaks it up again. So that's two times Oscar saved Bianca Belair and her championship. So now we get to the main. We get to the end. Where again, remember Becky was throwing everybody out. She was trying to make it one on one. She was trying to make make sure she secures the win. This time she did it one time too many. So it's Asuka and, um, and Becky. Um, Asuka's got the... She's got the Asuka lock locked in. Becky's trying to make it to the ropes. Even though if she makes it to the ropes, it don't matter because there's no disqualification. So obviously, if she gets to the ropes, it doesn't matter. Um, Bianca comes in. Who kicked? Was it Asuka that kicked or was it Becky? No. Um, no, it was Asuka. Um, so Bianca comes in, breaks it up. No, she doesn't break it up. Um, Bianca comes in, Oscar lets it go. Then she runs at Bianca. Boom, gives Bianca another kick. And I think Oscar's about to go for something. 
Bianca reversed with Yeah, she revert. No, I remember, I remember, I remember my fault, my fault. So um Oscar kicks Bianca. Bianca goes into the turnbuckle. Uh she, Oscar ran at her. Bianca catches her. Got in the glam slam. Boom on the turnbuckle. And then there we go. Bianca about to go for the KOD one more. It comes Becky running running up. Pushes Oscar off. Becky throws Bianca out. Here we go. Becky. Manhandle slam. Goes for the cover. Bianca gets back in the ring fast. Throws Becky out. This is the inverse of what Becky was doing. One, two, three. Bianca retains. Bianca Belair retains the Raw Women's Championship. As I said, all three did their thing. Great match. Becky looked devastated. That's all we had to say about that. <laughs> um, I said, perfect way to start the night off. After this, until the main event, nothing else was really... I mean, the the crowd was good. Like, this was a good Chicago crowd. Very good crowd tonight. They were kind of in there, and they kind of weren't there. Like, they, they were there. They were there. So I, I appreciate the Chicago crowd, right? What's next for all three of these women? I have no idea. I don't know who is next in line for Bianca at this point in time. It's literally just been Becky and Oscar for the last month. So, my only time will tell who is next in line. We will see. All right, on to the next one. Let's go.